Hi everyone, Mitch Jackson for Trial Lawyer Communication Tips for Everyone. You can check out my blog at MitchJackson.com. The reason I'm sharing this video with you is to talk to you about a mistake that many young trial lawyers make when giving their opening statements or closing arguments. It's a mistake that I see many keynote speakers make from the stage outside of the courtroom to an audience of 100 or an audience of 1,000. And what I'm talking about is the failure of a young trial lawyer or a keynote speaker to look their audience in the eye and connect with their audience. It's the failure to make eye contact with your audience. So the takeaway from this video is when you're presenting, if you're in court giving your opening statement, I want you to put down your iPad, put down your legal pad, don't look at your legal pad and read the facts, read the law, talk about the jury instructions, and not connect with your jury. Leave it on the counsel table, internalize the information. You've lived with the case. You know the facts. Trust yourself. Speak from the heart. Stand up. Look your jurors, each one of them, in the eye and talk to them. And while you're talking to them, I want you to feel them looking at you and watching you look at them. There's a relationship. It's all through eye contact. Same thing from the stage outside the courtroom. I want you to walk the stage and make eye contact with people in your audience. Select ahead of time who the people of influence will be in your audience and make eye contact with them. Use them as anchors during your presentation. Have a, have, create an environment where there's so much rapport and so much trust and interest built during your presentation that by the time you're done, your audience is going to leave and the room and take the intended action that you want them to take. You do this by connecting. You connect by using your eyes. So the next time you have an opening statement or a closing argument, I want you to speak from the heart leave your notes and everything else on the counsel table, stand up, make eye contact with each and every juror, and you'll have a, a much better experience. If you're giving a presentation from stage, don't pull out your smartphone. Don't just sit there like I watched someone do a couple of weeks ago for about 45 minutes uh, talking about social media, talking about Twitter, and all he did for 45 minutes was just read basically an outline that was on a smartphone. Now, I just did this for 15 seconds and it's annoying. Imagine what it's like for 45 minutes. So this individual would have been much more effective had he kept his smartphone in his pocket and simply stood and shared the information which he obviously had a good handle and a good grasp on. He knew his stuff, but he just didn't connect with his, with his audience because he didn't make eye contact. So that's about it. If you're shooting videos online, Look into the lens, make eye contact with your audience. Don't look over here while you're shooting a video that's taking place over here. Don't look down and read your notes while the video is shooting right here. Look your, look your audience right in the eye through the lens and the video will be much more effective. That's about it. Make eye contact when you're communicating. I don't care if you're in court. I don't care if you're on stage. I don't care if you're, you're involved in a one-on-one -on -one sales pitch or you're interviewing for a job, make eye contact with the other person, make eye contact with your audience, and good things will happen. If you like this communication tip, share it with your family and friends. Connect with me at MitchJackson.com, and uh, I always enjoy talking about different communication approaches and techniques, so reach out to me if you have something that you'd like to discuss with me. Other than that, I'm looking forward to seeing you online, and remember to always make today your masterpiece.